These seven reasons why narcissists pretend they don't know and go crazy. Have you ever had a close friend or family member cause you a lot of pain and stress, then act like nothing happened? You might have been left feeling confused, hurt, and angry because you couldn't figure out what they were doing. If this sounds like someone you've dealt with before, they might have been a narcissist. But why would an ego do something like this? Why do they hurt and then lie about what they did? You've come to the right place if you want to know the answers to these questions. In this video, we'll talk about seven reasons why, putting light on this strange behavior and giving you important insights into how a narcissist thinks. We also offer one-on-one -on -one consultations, which start at just $1 per week if you want more personalized help and guidance. Our team of experts is here to help you figure out how to deal with a narcissist and give you the tools and techniques you need to heal and move on. For more information, click on the link in the description. OK, let's get started. The first thing we'll talk about is feeling confused emotionally. If you're working with a sociopath, their purposeful mistakes can make things hard to understand. You start to wonder if the narcissist really doesn't know how much damage they've done. This can make it hard to figure out how you really feel and accept the truth of the situation. You start to doubt your own understanding of what's going on and wonder if you're overreacting or remembering things wrong. The second way to get someone to do what you want is called gaslighting. It includes acting like you don't know something to make you doubt your own memories, thoughts and sanity. The narcissist makes you question what you've been through and how you feel. This kind of psychological coercion can make you feel lost, alone and unsure about your own reality. The narcissist has an even stronger grip on you. Third, not caring about how someone else feels. When a narcissist acts clueless, it's because they don't want to feel pity. Narcissists can't accept when they're wrong, which can make victims feel like their pain isn't worth it or doesn't matter. This can make you feel even more alone in your feelings of hurt. Your feelings are not real, which can hurt your self-respect and sense of worth. You might even start to think your feelings don't matter. 4. Narcissists are known for acting like they don't know anything. They get in the way of solving the problem by acting like they don't know what's going on. This makes it hard for you to get closure or hold them accountable. No one seems ready to take responsibility for the problem or have a serious conversation about it. This makes you feel helpless. You feel like you have no way out of a dangerous position. Without closure, your mental pain will only get worse, making it harder for you to heal and move on. Also, your level of anger goes up. If the narcissist stays away from you, it only makes your relationship more difficult and hurts both of you. Fifth, avoiding taking responsibility. Narcissists can avoid taking responsibility for their actions by saying they don't know what will happen when they do something. Instead of taking responsibility for what they've done, they make it seem like you're being too sensitive. They keep coming after you until you give up and say you're sorry for asking them questions in the first place. The narcissist's avoidance makes you feel more confused and uncertain. You start to wonder if your response was right and your attention is taken away from the narcissist. This is a terrible way to make you think you are making the problem bigger than it is. 6. The ego keeps the balance of power off kilter by changing how you see them. This makes you feel like you need their support and understanding, and it keeps them in charge. Because of this imbalance of power, it can be hard to get away from them and regain your freedom, which can make you feel helpless and powerless. To make a narcissist happy, you might try to make them happy, keep quiet, and fix the mistakes you've made. But over time, this can make you lose your sense of who you are and make you slowly fade away. Seventh, when faced with proof of their bad behavior or criticism from others, 
narcissists often act like they don't know what's going on. This is a way for them to try to fix their status and protect how they see themselves. They care more about keeping up the appearance of being better and more pure than taking responsibility for the harm they've caused. In conclusion, narcissists use many different ways to stay in control and avoid being responsible. It's important to know that you can accept what you think and feel about a situation. Don't let the narcissist's attempts to control you make you question what you know to be true. It's important to get support and help from trusted friends, family members, or a doctor if you're getting over narcissistic abuse. When you need help, don't be afraid to ask for it. The link to our one-on-one -on -one consultation, which starts at just $1, is in the summary below. I hope that this has helped you. Please let me know if there's anything else I can do to help you get better after being abused by a narcissist. Take care and stay strong until we meet again.